All right, guys. So in today's video, I talk to you about ChatGPT. And honestly, if you're not using it, you're missing out. This is the honest truth. Now, how can you make money with ChatGPT, right? You could use it for some bullshit stuff, but really, let's you wanna make some money. So why not just ask ChatGPT or OpenAI the playground? Ask him different ways to make money. So let's give this a try. I'm screen recording my screen right now, and I'm here in the ChatGPT. So I'm a university student at the University of St. Andrews up north in Scotland. Let's ask him how to make money as a student. All right, so I'll ask him, what are some ways that I, as a university student, and you have to give them a lot of uh, information because the more you give them, the more they know. So at the uh, university, of St. Andrews can make money from the student population. All right, we can obviously just ask that and we want to give some more details. So what do we know? Students want to, they want to, there's different needs and um, wants, right? Keep in mind the needs of the needs and wants of students and how I can profit from these as a fellow student. Right, so we will just ask him that question and see what he can do. And obviously he is not working right now. So we just reload the page and ask my fellow friend again. All right, so if ChatGPT doesn't work, this is very important, just go to the open AI to the playground and this will always work. So it's almost the same. It's not as good uh, of a response, but it should do the job pretty much to the same extent. So let's see what it produces for us. So first of all, tutoring. We can offer tutoring services, obviously, based on what we know. Freelance writing, where you can, of course, use ChatGPT again to write um, assessments, you know, anything. You can offer to write essays and offer that on Fiverr, for example, where you can offer freelance work. Sell secondhand books. So this is something you can do, um, but what I also do, I'll make a video about this, selling secondhand bikes, for example. So I go on websites like Gumtree in the UK, or on I go on websites like um, just Facebook, Facebook Marketplace or eBay and buy a cheap bike for 20, 30, 40 pounds, okay? Then I'm in Facebook in the university groups. So there are different groups like University of St. Andrews group of 2023, 2024, 2025, whatever, join all the groups and post the same listings there for at least 50 pound profit okay so last week i bought a bike for 30 pounds of some old guy in i found it in gumtree and then i posted it for 100 pounds in the facebook group and of course the rich students they would then buy that bike so what you're doing is you're making use of market uh, misinformation okay buying at the normal price and selling to rich students who don't know the value of a bike okay event planning business all right you could like if you're a dj you could go to the union to the club and do some djing i know people who do that you can do offer personal shopping services. Um, I don't think that's a good idea. Why would anyone do that? Become a barista. Yeah, sure. You can do a regular wagey office job. Um, student photography, if you're into that. So really, you need to look at what are your skills and how can you make money of those skills? Next up, offer computer repair services. Yeah, I ain't doing that because I have no clue. Um, become a virtual assistant. Okay, it's a regular online job of a social media consulting service. So as you can see, ChatGPT really is helping us to find ideas. You could then ask him different things, just go return, ask him different ways. Um, I don't know, how can I make money today as a student? Okay, just go off there, keep asking him questions, he will give you new ideas. And this is really the beauty of the OpenAI software. So deliver food, exactly what I did. I signed up for Deliveroo. You will see here, oh, I almost fell down. I got my Deliveroo set, Deliveroo kit, which just arrived today and I will give that a try. Starting today, action, do it fast, do it with speed. Offer babysitting services. I don't know about that, maybe dog sitting. Participate in paid focus groups. Yes, for sure, the university, um, you know, people doing the research, PhD students who want to you to participate. Often you only get a little money, you know, you only get like five pounds or something. Uh, for example, just yesterday, the economics um, group, they sent out an email, they look for participants for a decision-making experiment. 
and I joined that um, make like 12 pounds of in 40 minutes or so you can do tutoring services if you're into that you can make a good I think 20 30 pounds I know people who make that as an online tutor do online surveys I tried that do not do that waste of time um, sell your old stuff for sure there um, I think it's called Depop or something where you can sell clothing of course you can go on eBay go on Facebook marketplace Gumtree just sell any unwanted stuff or just ask your friends what you can sell Delivering groceries, offering dog walking, exactly, become a freelance writer and translation services. So anyways, there's a lot of things which you can do online and also in person. If you're a student, I would urge you, and this is now my mentality, let's put this away and I'll talk to you here. This is my um, urging mentality to you, okay? If you are a student, you got your three, you got your four years as a student, however long it is, to make money, okay? Of course you're studying. But all you're doing is you're getting a, a university degree. Now, this might be controversial, but uh, nevertheless, please listen up. You get your university degree, okay? Everyone gets a university degree nowadays. You are nothing special, okay? You need to learn something, a skill that separates you. Either you build something up. I mean, if you're going to do a, a brokey job and <laughs> deliver food, sure, that's going to be a bit of money. That's not going to build anything long term. So what I personally do and what I recommend you and urge you guys to do is, yes, you need money coming in. You need cash flow. OK, you can only cut your expenses this much. But if they're, you know, at some point you have nothing to live off. So better way to make money is to increase your income. So what you do, do some jobs, do anything. You know, things like we just looked up to increase income. That money you will use either to invest in a better business or invest that money in what I would recommend um to in an etf which for example tracks the s p 500 okay that's the best way use of your money invest it there long term put um put any money you make really i i just put everything i have in there and then i would recommend you to work on something long term so for for me for example i have another youtube channel of mine which i link down in the description which is a gaming channel which i actually started in i think eighth grade when i was like 14 and managed to grow it up to it's like four, 34,000 subscribers now. One, mi one video is like 20 million views. So, and now I'm working on this channel, obviously. So this is kind of a long-term plan. A plan B, or if you want a plan A, whatever you want. And then you have, of course, your university, which you also have to do. But don't just do university. That's what I'm saying to you guys. Don't just think, oh, I'm going to get good grades. Bullshit. Everyone is getting good grades, okay? Gain some experience selling, like when I just went down to the kids there and tried to sell them, you know, in their lunchtime, crisps and cola, different kind of stuff. This is sales experience, okay? Just a small thing, but if, the, if like 100 kids come at you, do you have the guts, do you have the balls to go there and shout, guys, 50p for Coke? Yes, exactly, I was selling it very cheap, but 50p, please buy here. Um, and I wouldn't say please buy, but you get the idea. And yeah. Um, that's that's the idea that's the video for today so just make use of chat gpt like honestly it is we are living in the future you have to use it if you're not using it i mean why would you not use it exactly so guys that's all for today let me know if you have any questions suggestions otherwise see you next time